If people thought something was healthy, I tried to avoid it. I tried to pick things that people would say, ooh, that's either, ooh, that's gross, or ooh, that's not good for you. When I ate Oreos, I ate two. I ate the serving size, which is 140 calories. So that's two cookies. So this would be like a week's worth of food. And that's what I learned was I didn't need as much food as I thought I needed. So we buy Cheez-Its a lot. I prefer a wheat thin or a Ritz type cracker. I'll just get the regular box and not get too distracted by hint of salt, fiber. I mean, you know, which one's better? The, is it the higher fiber or the hint of salt better? One's lower sodium, one's higher fiber. Do you buy both and then mix? <laughs> Maybe. Maybe that's your best option. Anyway, or and then you mix it with a box of reduced fat. Um, as far as bread goes, try to get something that has, when you add protein and fiber together, it's more than five at least. And so this is eight. So then I'm looking at the, the protein and the fiber content. I'm price loyal. Around the $2 price range, we'll probably buy it versus I'm going to get the whatever brand and it happens to be $3.50, probably not going to buy it per loaf. If you look at just at my statistics, those, those things were good for me. And I'm not, I'm not saying that they were, but it, I wouldn't recommend those foods as far as you need to eat this way to be healthy.